All right, go for it. Tell me who's your favorite trombone player. I like J.J. Johnson. Yeah, because, you know, he, he's like one of the, the ones that discovered bebop on the trombone. Plus, his ideas are so melodic to me. And I just, J.J. Johnson has one of the best sounds to me. Is there any other trombone players you can think of that you really, really influence? I like influence? Dickie Wells. Yeah, Dickie Wells. He's, a very, he's an older trombone, but I like his phrases, the way he does things. Like, yeah, that's just disgusting. Yeah. What about sax players? One of your favorite sax players? John Coltrane, Charlie Park. I like all of them type. Joe Henderson. Those, yeah. Charlie Parker and John Coltrane in particular are some of my favorites. Hmm. Does it feel difficult to incorporate uh, the saxophone language to the trombone? Oh, yeah, because saxophones, they just, you know, they push on these keys and they, they able to hit these notes so fast and you try to do it on a trombone, you got to slide. You got to worry about all these different positions. Hmm. It's hard to do. So what, what advice would you have for a young uh, players starting out and, and on the trombone learning how to play some of those fast licks? <laughs> well, slow it down to your bet, to the best of your ability. Don't try to speed it up to where you can't and, or you'll get discouraged easy and mm -hmm. quick. Mm -hmm. Play the first, uh, maybe the first four bars to Donna Lee. I just want to hear it. I know you can four. do it. You don't have to do it slow. You don't have to do it fast. Do it like what feel comfortable. Yeah, <laughs> you did just fine, man. <laughs> hey, there was a time when you couldn't do it. So you took a lick like that, the head to Donna Lee, and you were able to play that slow. Can you play it slow? Can you try it? Or you, now you got it fast, you can't play it slow. I mean... I know how it is. <laughs> still, I'm still working it. Yeah, me? that's what we're going to work today. So, yeah. Anything else you want to add? Oh. Oh, listen to a lot of jazz music. You you have to listen to know how to speak. Mm -hmm. Like, who would you start with? I mean, I, I listen to everybody. I just listen to a lot of people. Mm -hmm. Some people say start with Miles Davis, kind of blue. Yeah, because he, he seems more simple and easier to understand. Okay. So start with something simple that you can understand. Don't start hardcore. Yeah. Charlie oh, Parker, because you'll get discouraged. Yeah, you don't want to, I mean, you want to listen to that, because eventually you're going to have to learn how to understand it. You don't want to just pass it up, but that's going to be hard to understand the first time you listen to jazz. Okay, cool, man. All right, well, we're going to get this rehearsal started. So I'm going to text uh, JJ. Let's get over here.